multiply any number by 9 9999 9, etc in three different methods method 1 this method is applicable if both the numbers have same number of digits or the first number has just one less number of digits than the second number for example, 67 times 99. Subtract 1 from 67. 67 minus 1 equals 66. Successor of 99 is 100. Subtract 67 from 100. 100 minus 67 equals 33. So the answer is 6633. Let's do another example. 52 times 999. 52 minus 1 equals 51. Successor of 999 is 1000. 1000 minus 52 equals 948. So the answer is 51948. Method 2. This method is applicable if the first number has just one more number of digits than the second number. For example, 86 times 9. Here successor of 8 is 9. So subtract 9 from 86. 86 minus 9 equals 77. Successor of 9 is 10. Subtract the 1's digit that is 6 from 10. 10 minus 6 equals 4. So the answer is 774. Let's do another one. 123 times 99. Successor of 1 is 2. 123 minus 2 equals 121. Successor of 99 is 100. Since 99 is a two-digit number, we subtract the number formed by last two digits that is 23 from 100. 100 minus 23 equals 77. So the answer is 12177. Method 3. This method can be applied in any type that means whether both the numbers have same number of digits or have different number of digits. Let's do the same examples once again. 67 times 99. 99 has two digits. So add two zeros to the extreme right of 67. It is 6700. Now subtract 67 from 6700. 6700 minus 67 equals 6633. So the answer is 6633. 52 times 999. 999 has three digits. So add three zeros and then subtract 52. 52,000 minus 52 equals 51,948. So the answer is 51,948. 643 times 9,999. 9,999 has four digits. So add four zeros and then subtract 643. 64 lakh 30,000 minus 643 equals 64 lakh 29,357. So the answer is 64 lakh 29357. Thank you for watching.